The easiest way to stay on program is to acknowledge all types of PRs at all types of rep ranges. Now when it comes to PRs, people usually think that they have to hit a new one rep max. And anything more than a singular rep is not really considered a PR. But here's the thing, your form, your technique, your grindability, type 1, type 2 muscle groups, whatever type of build you have on your physique, your ability to grind at different reps changes. Personally for myself, I suck at doing anything more than 3 reps, and I suck at matching a projected 1 rep max after doing 4 reps. So instead of calculating the PR and saying, hey this doesn't match up to my all time PR, just take a mental note of any reps that you've done with that set, and if it exceeds what you've done in the past, it's definitely considered a personal record.